Hi, this is Hans, W1JSB with Radio Set Go. And here is a capacitive touch key circuit, what I call the cap key, um, that I designed with some help. Um, I'll demonstrate what it does. Basically, it senses capacitance change through skin contact. I have the two inputs here connected to these metal contacts. And when this is connected to a keyer, as this one is here, you can touch one side and you get dits, the other side you get DAWs. And touching both of them at the same time will alternate, so it's iambic functioning. Uh, back to the circuit here, the two inputs have ESD suppression, so no worries uh, of static charge taking out the IC. Uh, optically isolated output and operates on 12 volts with a 3.4 volt regulator here, so you could bypass this if you wanted to use a button cell or couple triple A's or something like that. Um, it's very simple. Um, as far as mounting, you could put some uh, double-sided tape on it or something like that and uh, put it inside a little enclosure or do something creative with it to make uh, a really fun to use responsive key that I like as much or even more than expensive keys like uh, the Begali or um, the Begali here or the Shore. Uh, they're very high-end mechanical keys, but it takes a little bit of getting used to to use the capacitive touch keys. Um, they can be more sensitive and if you're not used to that then you sort of have to adjust <laughs> your own internal timing So if you're interested, I have them for sale on my website. They're $35 plus $3 or so for shipping within the U.S. All right, thanks for watching. 7-3.